the thing um, women's race need is attention. That's the most important thing, attention. Geet Langedok's been organising Ghent Vevelgem for the past 20 years and has been a vital part in the fixture, appearing on both the UCI World Tour and UCI Women's World Tour. With a busy schedule organising seven races in Flanders fields on the same day, Geet still finds time to promote women's cycling and has been integral to its growth worldwide. Well, first of all, we use a bit or abuse a bit the attention from the men's race to get attention for the women's race. Um, this is very good. We do it on the same day, very important. The public is over there. Um, the VIPs are over there. Press, media, television coverage, public, VIPs. Let us show them women's race. And it's once we have this attention, the money will come. And once the money is there, then we can talk about same price money and things like that. We use the attention for the men's race, we use, use the money from the men's race to finance, organize and get the attention for the women's race. So that's what we're doing. It's very important that women have the same rights as men have. So I think it was a, a natural step um, some 10 years ago to think about women's race. It took us some years before we were able to realize it and um, I'm very happy with it. We have this saying in Flemish, what you can't see, you can't laugh. Lots of races in Flanders are held in the Flemish Ardennes and we have some kind of a extraordinary parkour. Not a lot of races do the moor where there is a lot of wind or do the Camelberg. So uh, we have uh, quite an exceptional Flemish race. The week before the race I uh, compare it to a big puzzle with all these little pieces and uh, during the months and weeks before the race we have to gather all the pieces and then putting the puzzle together is like uh, two weeks before the race so that's my most busiest week because the day itself normally if everything goes well i don't have to do anything we're already doing some stuff for next year's race um, like taking options on buildings and things like that infrastructure you need for the women's uh, and the men's race things like that and let's say it doesn't stop anymore um, because you start evaluating in april and as you are evaluating you're already starting to prepare the new race so uh, but that's okay that's okay I think there are a lot of reasons why the race grew the last years. First of all, moving back to a Sunday. Uh, we used to be on a Sunday before. Um, so moving back to the Sunday and being able to have uh, more kilometers. And also what um, made the race bigger is really identifying us with the in Flanders fields. And uh, we just looked to our parkours and said what we are doing is really riding on the front line and having this connection looking for the stories that connect the race with Flanders fields and being able to tell the story of what happened here 100 years ago by a race really helped us growing the race and we had some very uh, exceptional editions like the wind edition and the snow and some big winners the last year so that's the reason why it grew. <laughs>